Marcella Shale has natural gas. It's bound up in rock deep under Pennsylvania that uh, with the extraction of it has the potential of generating significant amounts of dollars for Pennsylvania, but it also has very clear environmental implications. And it's a very large issue uh, that fundamentally could transform Pennsylvania. About two thirds of the state is actually covered by Marcellus. So companies are interested in leasing and have been interested in leasing a very large area. So a lot of landowners are affected by that. It's an issue that uh, is dividing some people. There's a chance to, uh, to earn a lot of money on the one side. But the other people are interested in making sure that the richness of the area that they live in, you know, the beauty, the clean water, they want to make sure that that all gets taken care of. What we've tried to do in Cooperative Extension is to present a lot of the facts and, and uh, show them some of the details that are important as they consider some of the aspects of leasing. Cooperative Extension taught workshops throughout all the Commonwealth that's critically important to those who are seeking that information and haven't made their decision about a lease or waiting to have something happen in their given community. Now they can make it from a, a position of strength and an informed position. We own 50 acres of forest. In 1979, I signed a lease for a dollar an acre. After signing, for three years, I got a total of $219. I had forgotten about it until I started going to the extension meetings. I went to that first meeting, and we came out of that meeting knowing how one goes about leasing the land and what you need to do to protect your land. After the educational process from Penn State, we've been able to generate about an extra uh, $200 million in the difference between what their first offers were and what the final outcome was with the uh, leases. Penn State brings the expertise to the community in, in many different ways, and, and I think you need people out in the field really talking to people face-to-face you know, -face so you can get the right information to the people that are wanting this information and, and don't know where to go. The value of education in this process is absolutely huge. So Penn State has a lot to offer to develop more of that resource and keep more of those energy dollars, uh, number one here in the United States and more importantly here in Pennsylvania.